Weight senior Anna Compost won last week's district diving meet to advance to the state meet for the fourth year in a row. A former gymnast, a trip to one of her brother's swimming meets turned her on to diving. That athletic background, along with her confidence and the degree of difficulty in her dives, are her biggest strengths. The years of experience have really helped me a lot. Um, looking back on my freshman year, I would get scared going into really big meets, and now looking back, I had no reason to. She's been down there every single year since she was a freshman, so she knows what to expect and she knows what she needs to do. A lot of her improvement has come from um, a belief in herself, you know, that, that she's better than, um, she gets better and better every year. Um, we work on developing the DD. This, is what, this year is a culmination of about nine years worth of work. She's gotten a lot more DD in her dives. Um, again, with the confidence, she's gotten a lot more confidence in her dives. She has one of the hardest lists dif degree of difficulty wise in the state, so that puts her ahead of everyone else automatically. 23rd as a freshman, 16th two years ago. Last year, as a junior, Compost finished 8th in the state. That experience is giving her plenty of confidence heading into her final state diving meet. I do, I do. Um, I think that this year has by far been my best year, and so I'm really confident going into seats this year. Absolutely, I have full confidence. I, I expect uh, at least top three. Um, state meet, when, you get, when you're surrounded by 24 really good divers, you get intimidated, and each year you get a little bit better. Last year was a culmination of her believing that she belonged and she could compete. This year, she knows she's there. She made podium last year, so I would expect a podium finish and I would expect a top five finish from her. It's a lot of pressure because everyone's watching you and obviously like they see your mistakes. It's very obvious, but I tend to block it out. That way I don't have to worry about what anybody else thinks. I just, you know, go out there and do what I have to do. Yeah, I clear my mind. That way I don't worry about it and, you know, panic. With a lack of facilities in the City League, Compost travels across the city to St. Francis to practice. That dedication, talent, and success can be an inspiration to the next generation of Glass City divers. I've coached for 23 years and she's my first TPS diver. Um, I talked to Dr. Durant you know, that we have uh, untapped potential, and I think the recognition and, and the awareness that this is gonna bring to the Toledo area, I'm hoping that we can get a couple more uh, TPS kids interested in the sport. The degree of difficulty in her dives are comparable to a college divers, and she does hope to compete at the next level with Cincinnati, Wright State, Youngstown State, and Bowling Green expressing interest. In Toledo, Mark Hoots, BCSN.